an expired listing is obviously if there's a term with a listing agreement. It expires because it didn't sell. Withdrawn and terminated is basically normally it's the seller withdraws the listing, so they're pretty pissed at the at the agent typically, right? Because yeah. they withdrew or they terminated the listing. So I know that I used to always I when I was wholesaling properties back a long time ago, uh, but I made I was very very successful with expired, withdrawn, and terminated listings. Like that was my bread and butter for for getting deals. Um, would that work with something like this or is it too, I'm thinking it, I, I don't know. My, my personal opinion is, is it may be a little bit too businessy for someone, but that's just my own opinion from how I, the way that I approached it before was, Hey, I'm just an investor. I own properties in the area. If you're looking to sell, let me know I'm looking to buy. And that was basically my letter that I would send to people.